Hello, everybody. This is Talking with Burritos. That casual conversation you usually have with friends about random and sometimes obscure topics, like that one time in bed camp. Nope, that wasn't a flute, but a parasitic worm, which slowly made its way into your lower intestine via root vagina. In this episode, Jerry, Adam, and Chris, they go after the mythical sock monster and other cryptoids like Loch Ness and Bigfoot. So now we want to go to our... Oh, our main topic of today. So what are we talking about? We're going to talk about um, mythical creatures. Cryptoids. Most, cryptoids. Preferably, what? Crypt- cryptoids. That's what cryptoids? they're called. That's what they're called. Yeah. Oh, shit. Cryptoids. Okay, we're going to talk about the sock monster and, <laughs> and, and cryptoids. Like that elusive sock monster that I just can't. All right, let's talk about this damn sock monster. Like, out of all the monsters, I think this is the most formidable, <laughs> in my opinion. Motherfucker well, steals our socks. It's, he steals the fucking socks, man. Well, he only steals one. Where? One. He steals one. Yeah, he steals he one steals socks. One. What the fuck is wrong with him? <laughs> like, no, seriously, I'm fucking angry. Look at that basket. It's a white basket over there, and it's full of just socks. That have no pair. That have no pair. And I don't get it either because I, They're I divorced. legitimately, I put both my socks into my grocery bag, yeah. you know, and making sure, you know, th- so I don't lose them because I like to make sure I have them matching. Yes. I Same still here. miss one. I still you miss still one at the end of lunch one. day. How the fuck is that possible? But where does it go? <laughs> you can search <laughs> fucking tooth and nail. You can search like underneath couches. You can list everything. You can put everything out of your house and you still would not find that damn sock. I don't understand it. It's, is your dryer taking it? Is it eating it up, disintegrating within the water or in the Is there in a the magical washer? portal that requires yeah. a sock every time you use it? Oh, fucking no, man. But that's... I hate the sock monster. So I, you are. Seriously, you have five people in a house, too? Wait, wait, how many? Five, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five people in the house. That's a lot of socks. That is a lot that's of socks. That's a lot of missing socks. It's so frustrating. And then you don't want to throw that sock away because you have the hope that that sock will return. <laughs> like fucking Hansel and Gretel and shit. Yep. And he's like, oh, I want the little thing. They want them to return from that little house. They're not going to return. They're being eaten by the lady who cooked them in a pot. Well, only one, well, one of them got eaten. Only one of them? Yeah. Hansel. Okay. In my story, they all both got eaten. Fuck Gretel them. was a slave. Gretel? Yeah. Sex slave? No, no. Oh, okay. Regular slave. I'm like, damn. It went deep back then. Yeah. They did go deep. Uh, that but not that deep. Not that deep. Okay, cool. But no, seriously, what the fuck is up with this sock monster? <laughs> now, what do you think the sock monster looks like? I drew this thing. Somebody somebody said I drew like a little sketch of it. I can't remember remember where I put it. It was like a little quick sketch. He's he got like the little round face. Like not like uh somebody said cookie monster. Oh, that like, was me. Yeah, but then I I drew him like a face like not grimace. He has like a oval like a watermelon head. <laughs> and like uh he has his teeth and his like little spiky hair is coming up and he just always has socks hanging, uh, hanging out, out of his, his mouth hanging out of his mouth. <laughs> and that's how he talks. He's like blah, blah. it's like snuck of a when his nose moves or something. I got the socks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he just has socks in his mouth at all times. Dude, because that one sock that you want you find that little motherfucker, you beat him to death and get your sock back. Why didn't monsters eat? Did they ever have a sock monster? I remember no. the one sock. No, they can't touch so. they Yeah, can't they touch couldn't touch him. Anything because yeah. of the germs. I think they should. Maybe no, they should. It, it wouldn't work anymore. Okay. It doesn't well, work. Somebody if, needs to It doesn't this. work after Monsters He's Inc. Just either because they're now they're funny. The, just as bad as the Koopa Kadru. Koopa Kadru. Chupa Cabra. Koopa. What? Chupa Cabra. Koopa Cabra. Chupa Cabra. Koopa. What the fuck? I said it yesterday. Koopa Cabra. What the hell? Koopa Cabra. Koopa Cabra. Okay. It's. It's. Koopa. Chupa Cabra. Koopa Cabra. Cool. Chew. Chew. Chupa. Chupa okay, cabra. Chupa cabra. <laughs> Chupa cabra. Chupa. Chupa cabra. Chupa cabra. Yeah. All right. The goat Chupa sucker. Cabra. The goat sucker. <laughs> like, <laughs> no, but seriously, sock monster. Sock monster. I honestly. I had I a think, nice pair of socks and I like motherfucker took them. I think the sock monster is actually, he is just, he's just a pair of hands. Yeah. Very disgusting looking hands. But they're giant hands, so he needs a sock for each finger. And that's why he steals the socks. How many socks does he need, though? 
Well, they get dirty. He's got to replace them. But where does he live? In, in an asshole, because apparently those, so- those socks get dirty, so he needs a sock every week. I just don't know. Like, some... Th- th- I don't know why <laughs> this, Maybe this question lives. perplexes me, but fuck, where does those damn socks go? You Maybe can, he b- lives behind the dryer. Where do your socks go? Maybe he lives behind the dryer, and that's what, you know, drawers, behind the dryer is kind of dirty. We don't go b- behind there. That's True. where he lives. Maybe. You know, it's a good place to hide, yeah. you know? We could pull out that dryer right there. And, and you can just... secretly, you know, and you can, you know, like, we don't pay attention to when our dryers are, you know, going. You know, he could secretly just open it up, steal that sock, close it, turn it back on. And be gone without you even noticing. No, you would know if the door opens because it no. stops. See, it's probably tiny and it lives in the lint trap. And so Ooh. it just. Because yeah. you don't see the lint trap. Just That's eats, true. Yeah. That's true. Eats the sock that way. This shit frustrates me so much. I was doing laundry and it's like, where? Seriously, where? Because you try to put them, you try to take them off and put them in the hamper. It's yeah. like, okay. My socks are inside the hamper. <laughs> okay, I take my socks out. I put them inside the washer. Okay, same socks. And then I put them, take them, uh, uh, remove them from the washer and put them into the dryer. And then you take them bitches out to like match them up and at least one of them is gone. <laughs> it's like, I don't understand yeah. it. It's fucked up. It's weird, man. Do you not understand like <laughs> why this perplexes me? It fucking angers me because like, why should I have to go buy socks all the damn time? And you don't want to throw away. And, and then why? Why can't you just throw away the other sock? The wife won't let me throw away the other sock. Because. What if you find it? There's hope that there's a, the, the other the, the lost sock would return. A new it's like hope. fucking lo- episode of Lost. What if they're on like an island? With the sock monster. Yeah. Sock, you know, it's like that that blurry black thing. That yeah, the, the, smoke, show monster, up, the yeah. smoke monster is the, the smoke sock monster. monster. Is the <laughs> Maybe, right? <laughs> Maybe Give me sock no monster sock. Is, comes in a form of heat. Ooh. Maybe he has to thrive in heat with the, what's it called, huh? inside the dryer. You know, once you turn that sucker on, that's when he comes up because, you know, that's when it gets heated Maybe. up. Maybe. You know, and that, you know, and then when you turn off the dryer, he, instant, he instantaneously steals one sock and disappears Maybe. in that gas form, you know. I think we have to investigate this a little further. We're going to have to put a camera inside the dryer. Yes. (laughs) I know. (laughs) (laughs) All right, we tried it out. Uh, Don't do it. Don't do it. (laughs) Dude, could we, we, like, do you think it's possible to mount something like an expedition or some type of exploratory, like, crew like they do with, like, ghost hunters and the Bigfoot that recently, like, can we just go to people's houses and, like, (laughs) Hunt for the elusive sock monster. Just get one of those dryers that has like the glass door on it, and then just put a camera in front of the door. Ooh, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. See if you see a face. What if he's like that is like the most boring. No, we ever just go to the laundry <laughs> mat. We go to the laundry mat. They yeah. have it. Yeah, we just put a camera in front of them. Because you might know, look weird. Creepy about guys. You <laughs> might look weird. They shit. like, what the fuck? Are you video recording laundry? This is yes. for this science. Is science. <laughs> walk the walk the fuck away if you don't want to see it. Cause it's it, like we're seriously. here to protect you people. Yeah, we're, we're, we're trying to get get to the bottom of this. I say we do it. <laughs> we put together a crew. I think that's for like Chris and his boys. <laughs> I can see that with all kind of like retro, like radio old gadgets yeah. like attached to the belts and stuff like that. Little radio. Oh, trans- I'm getting I'm getting I'm getting heat sensitive. Yeah, radio transmitters. So you got like this thing with like uh, like a hanger. Like <laughs> it's got like one of the wire hangers off of it. it has an antenna and shit. It and they got every- these big ass headphones. <laughs> It'll beep every once in a while. Say like, beep. <laughs> beep. I got something. <laughs> Yo, over here. Over here, over here, <laughs> over at this washer. <laughs> yeah, you guys are just head up there, just going around the entire laundry mat, trying to like, uh, trying to like get, get an ectometer, like ectograph on some on everyone else's laundry, and they're just looking at you like, the fuck, man, <laughs> why are you messing with my laundry? No, you gotta interview people too, and be yeah. Like, are you missing like, any socks? Are you missing? <laughs> yeah. have, you, have you folded your socks have yet? You folded your socks yet? No, you but one? I'm about to. Hey, hey, hey. Come over here, Come over here. <laughs> Joe, 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 bring the camera. <laughs> this lady's about to freaking blow our minds. She's about she's to about fold, fold, fold her, her socks. socks. And he's just like, <laughs> you put like the music soundtrack going. It's like, dun, dun, dun. It is all about the reveal. <laughs> no, like, I was like, you have to have like the music from uh, Inception. So it's like, <laughs> <Yeah>. boom. <laughs> <laughs> he's watching her slowly. 
<laughs> do her song. That's go, a script go ahead, for you, Chris. Just, just, I'm like really scripted out a script for you right now. <laughs> An idea. <laughs> like this lady folded her slides. And she's like, oh no, it's one missing. <laughs> and then that's when the whole All right, this is playing. inconclusive. This is inconclusive. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hmm. Did you come in with did you did you did you uh, were you are you sure you came in with that sock <laughs> and then you have to take them to their homes to see if they lost their sock <laughs> see if they can locate it but have you guys ever lost a favorite pair of socks never really oh wait no i did what? have a favorite pair of yeah. socks and i did lose them i did not you never had a favorite pair of socks no I wear sandals a lot too yeah yeah you really do i do too but you know i still have a favorite pair of socks for work, there was one know? i thought was lost it was like these pair of socks I used to wear when I played basketball, like every day. It was like these little Jordan 23 pair of socks. I still have them to this day, I think. Um, actually, I do. Where are they? They might be somewhere in the in the room. But Only I think, one of yeah, them. Just the, oh, no, no, no. They actually have two. I thought I lost it a long time ago, but the song monster, I guess he granted me um, a wish. A pardon. Or, favor. Yeah, you a got favor, a pardon. A pardon. <laughs> He's like, here's your sock. Because I, I was so, so devastated that I lost this sock. Because I played, I used these socks back in maybe... High school, right? Yeah, I think it was high school. Freshman year, I bought these pair of socks. And I used to just like, I used to keep a little card of like a Jordan card or a Todd Day or something like that. My favorite basketball player inside the sock, too. And so these are my favorite socks. So I love those socks. And they're pretty cool. But, and one day, I think I was an adult. I think later on, it's like, I lost, a, I lost the sock. I wasn't wearing them anymore, but I just lost one. And then I think we were moving once and then it just showed up. It was weird, like when I clean like house, clean like the room and stuff. It just all of a sudden, it's like you move, remove the bed, you lift up, and there's a sock. There's all the porn in there. So oh, it's like actually, it was I do cool. have a pair of Under Armour socks. Yeah, and they're like compression socks, which is really weird. Yeah, but I lost the other one. Aren't all socks compression and, socks? Well, I don't know. It had like padding and stuff. And it <laughs> yeah. was weird. And I, and I only bought it because uh, the Spartan race. And I was oh, like, okay, yeah. so yeah, I thought yeah. I'd try it out. You a douchebag really nice. with socks. Yes, no, they were half socks. You couldn't tell. Oh, okay. I thought you had the length ones, the uh, one that goes no. up to the knees and shit like that. She's like, I, I'm good. <clears throat> I'm, I'm important. Although I didn't <laughs> look like that douchebag because I was decked out in like Under Armour shorts. Did you? Yeah. Like, uh, and then I actually had Under Armour on. <laughs> 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 so yeah it was like, like oh look at this guy he went to go shop at fucking Foot Locker before he came oh, and I was wearing Under Armour <laughs> shoes <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. this guy went to Foot Locker just to get dirty just to get tell dirty. him about your story though <laughs> when he lost his glass and it broke his ankle <laughs> it was my foot man yeah <laughs> you broke your foot yeah <laughs> Uh, it's so sad. I finished <laughs> hobbling. Yeah, it's like, like looking at Jackass hobbling across the damn finish line in his armor, under armor. You ain't so fucking tough now, but are you with that tough armor? <laughs> what happened? Huh? Sorry. Did I you went, see that look that he had? Yeah. Like, like he was like staring at something, like he just saw the sock monster. <laughs> Did you see that motherfucker? No. Did no. you see him? Like. How He's coming you, to visit me today. How do you defeat the sock monster? You can't. If she, if she saw that motherfucker. Give it your underwear. No, that wouldn't work. No. You don't want him to become an underwear monster because then you fucking He's miss his underwear. He's underpants and sock monsters in. He needs both. Yeah. How would you combat the sock monster? It would be like going against Slimer or something. I don't know. I just feel like a whole ghost. Fill a sock full of nickels thing. and smack him. Hmm. What would that do? Why would that hurt him? It's the well, because it's a sock full of nickels. You gotta hurt fucking anybody. <laughs> yeah, anybody with a fucking sock full of nickels. Do you have to roll them up first? No, no. No? Just, just pour those nickels right in. Oh, okay. Just well, if bow. anybody has any other ideas about this mythical sock monster, or if, they, if you have seen him, hey, go to talkingwithritos.com. Leave us a comment on this episode. We need to know. Yeah, we need to know. We need to get to the bottom of this shit. I want to believe. And if you have a favorite pair of socks that's missing a pair, Put them online. I say you post them. You find I say it. you post them on our Facebook page so that we can maybe. Because what if they? What if they? This is like some some kind of portal. We can and make. What a if he's poster. like at somebody else's house and he drops another pair of socks? We might have your sock. Because have you had like a sock that you can't rec- that you don't recognize? Yeah. yeah, I've had that. Yeah, like what the fuck? I didn't buy this sock. I'm like, wife, did you buy this sock? No, I didn't. Kids, you guys don't buy socks. Okay. <laughs> uh, no, ask the did, you take like, did you take socks someone's home? sock? No, I didn't take it. Like, who the fuck's that? I think I got mad at my daughter once. <laughs> no, I think it was a pair of underwear. 
Uh, it was a small pair of underwear, like like boxers. I'm yeah. like, they mine. Who the fuck is these? And I totally <laughs> went after her. I was about to. I was like, who the fuck underwear is this? And like, I was mad for a long time. And my wife was like, what the fuck? Whose underwear are these? And like, they, no one knew it. I was mad at everybody. Like, somebody's motherfucking lying. Whose underwear are these? I ain't talking to no. I was about to unleash the fucking fury upon someone's head. Uh, I don't care. I don't. Someone gonna go is to jail. legitimately living in your house. I was gonna go to jail that day. Like, oh no! The only person naked up in his head is me. Wait, they can't shower naked. God damn it! Huh? They can't shower no, naked. No, just me. God damn it! No, no. But it turns out that my niece, my wife, came over and she like wears the boxers. She like, oh yeah, wear like uh, from yeah. pajamas and stuff like that. Yeah. And it was they were, they were hers. <laughs> <laughs> After I flipped the fuck out, because I think I had to go to work that night, so. That I went to work angry because I, I didn't know who, who the, the fuck's fuck, underwear. Who's this? underwear these words? I was about to erase some holy fucking hell. <laughs> and then we turned out, you know, because it was like my wife was like asking everybody. Who's, I think she asked her mother in law, and I think, and then she was uh, like, oh, yeah. yeah. Um, what's her name? Is missing a pair of like underwear, like um, boxers. Those are hers. I'm like, oh. Did I feel like a jackass? No. Because no, at the moment. That's a legitimately yes. thing to get angry hey, at yeah, the moment. It is legit. I was in the right. Okay, you got a teenage daughter. You never know what's going on in their little brains or anything like that. You know, she was brazen enough to try to bring somebody up in her. I go, I fucking dare you. I will choke the fucking shit out of somebody. Sorry. I have this vision in my head of killing, choking the hell out of somebody. So it's going to happen one day. <laughs> Were you little? See me locked up. And like, yep, I choked the shit out of somebody. Yeah. yeah. Tomato, tomato. Joe be a homer. Yeah. Fuck, man. Seriously. All right, but <laughs> we saved your ass in World War Two. Well, we saved your asses in World War Three. Sorry, Simpsons. You always pulling out the damn Simpsons quotes, man. No, I'm gonna quote that on the episode. <laughs> Show notes. Like, like we say, like we. I'm gonna start doing that. Just have to listen. Just take random quotes from Chris that he, uh, that he just throws out there. Oh, well, right. like you should have a Simpsons counter. So every time he, like, yeah, makes a think, quote, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> drinking game. Well, I, I, well, since we're going to, are we going to talk about other? Yes, we're going here? into that right well, now. I was going to talk about Futurama because they're like, Nessie was just a giant log with a Halloween mask on it. <laughs> <laughs> what about the Nessie? Oh, uh, Nessie. Like, I, I don't think Nessie's real. I think, I don't think oh, Nessie's real either. I think Nessie is legitimately a log. But what about those? Yeah. Well, I found With a Halloween thing. mask on it. <laughs> <laughs> what if somebody draw that? I should draw that with a log. Well, that was on Futurama. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, oh. there was like a freaking big ass <laughs> Halloween mask on a log. Nessie's just disputed. What? There's this actual thing on Wikipedia where it has. Yeah, like, they have. A li- <laughs> yeah, I've been on yeah, that before. It has a long list of like all the cryptoids where it's like unconfirmed, disputed, um, fake, and, and oh, really? I guess. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I remember what else But you have to think, though, at this moment in time, that unless. How long did a no dinosaur one, live? Not that long, unless it has a mate. Yeah. You know? So. And how. And we've only seen one Loch Ness, supposedly. So, therefore, how could he procreate? She. And she. And why would it. And how could it live so long? It's like 100 some Maybe years asexual. Old. Maybe asexual. Ooh, and asexual. It can only, like, give out one spawn every 20 years or something. Possible. Oh. Yeah. That's a theory Because you know uh, There are lizards in There are There's a whole Thing of just Female lizards in Mexico And they just Reproduce asexually Wow Yeah That is fucking neat They can fuck themselves (laughs) Yeah I guess I mean we can fuck ourselves also Oh I guess so (laughs) Oh I guess so (laughs) That'd be weird yeah, just that just reminds me of fertilize your own egg. That just reminds me of uh. So they they uh, fertilize their own eggs, right? Yeah, they fertilize their own eggs. Interesting. Yeah. Wow. So technically, they're just cloning themselves. So what if the Loch Ness does exist? But have we ever have they have have they have any any, any recent sightings? I Not that I know. The last one was of. like 2010, I think. Yeah. Really? Like, I remember there was like someone like I think I, I think you're talking. Yeah, I, I yeah. remember what you're talking about. I, I read that. I saw that little headline and. Did I click on it? Yes, I did. Of course. I was like, oh shit, this motherfucker's alive. What's up, Adam? You got any factoids for us, sir? Oh, well, on their list, it had unconfirmed and confirmed and stuff like that. And 
I haven't found any that are actually confirmed. Yeah, I'm pretty sure none of them are going to be confirmed. <laughs> well, that or they like I other gotta, animals. Well, yeah, I'm gonna put it in the show the notes. Confirmed. I'm gonna put in the show notes like you see Loch Ness unconfirmed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was the other term that they use? Uh, disputed. Disputed <laughs> and extinct also. He does, yeah, and extinct. And extinct. <laughs> yeah, I. Uh, well, the extinct ones always make me sad. Because what about that picture though? Do you give any validity to that um picture? The one with like the freaking yeah the famous like head headshot. Great, it's like it, it does a hump too. A part, yeah, a body yeah, there's a hump and well. there's that. Yeah, it's a log. No, not no. Godzilla. It's not Godzilla. That is definitely not Godzilla. <laughs> it's Godzilla's finger. You know. Yeah, <laughs> coming out of the water. <laughs> All right. So okay, that one's disputed. So also, what people about, think it's like a what's it called a sturgeon or something like one of those giant fucking fish. Oh, also, but I'm like sturgeon. I don't I don't think it's a sturgeon. No. It's not a sturgeon. How big do they grow? I think they get pretty damn big. Seriously, do they how come out come out the water uh, come out of the water? Water? I think they do. They come out like that. No, not like I that. Don't know. Hmm. Okay, let's give life to this branch thing theory. Maybe it is just a log. It is a log. Hmm. <laughs> a could log with a lo- Could it just be some type of other serpent? I don't know. Because the way they draw, hey, they draw them like a like Ireland. a like a um like Ireland. a. Uh, Saint Saint Patrick took away all the snakes. Remember? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, wait, no, it's in Scot- no snakes I in forgot Ireland. Scotland. Scotland? There's no snakes in Scotland. I thought no. I think it's Ireland, but like, but but, but Nessie's you got to think though. They usually do they dwell in cold climates? Not Nessie. That, I don't well. think so. No, not, not well. well. No. What's up? Oh, I thought you meant Nessie. I was like, no. I don't think Nessie could survive in a fog, you know, and. Yeah. Like, it could be cold. Like, I don't know how cold it gets there. Is there you know? any, like, what river is that, um, um, is she attached to? Am I, is there, ha- her, Loch it's Ness. Habitus. Is this Loch, ne- Loch Ness? But what other body of water is it attached to where it can feed into? I think it's attached into? to an ocean? Yeah. Is it, it that? Might, it might be Atlantic. Ant- Atlantic, It'd maybe? Be, it would be the Atlantic okay. Ocean. So. Unless it's a sea, Is there any idea, any, 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 any chance that it's just, like, within the depths of the fucking ocean that we, where we don't know like where we don't really travel and where there's all kinds of fucking creatures down there that could be a you frill don't shark. want to see <laughs> a frill shark jumping up out of the water. Yeah. Hmm. Those things are ugly. Could it be something from the depths of the ocean? I don't know. And they just dwell down there. I don't think anything like has like a neck like that though, or to make a head and a hump, you know, hmm. what if it's just a dinosaur? Everybody walked the dinosaur. Everybody on the floor. <laughs> but you know, it could have been like just a, an extinct dinosaur that decided not to go extinct. Yeah, and it just who survived the volcanic eruptions I'm, yeah. because he was in the water and he lay dormant for years. She, I, I thought they were. I thought everyone is asexual. pretty pretty more agreed on the asteroid thing that crashed into Earth. Yeah, that's true too. <laughs> I'll go with that one. But yet, she's in the depths of the water. Did it kill everything though? It didn't kill everything. No, no, it just caused a lot of blackness yeah. and darkness. Yeah. So they couldn't grow that much food. So he can grow. So he's within the depths of the ocean. It was already dark. So he's, it's accustomed yeah. to it. Yeah. And maybe he just ate, ate yeah. the algae. Just comes out every and now fish. and then when something awakens it. <laughs> Sci-fi. Okay. Oh, like Godzilla? <laughs> no, no, right? Yeah. <laughs> when he needs to save a city. <laughs> the city of Scotland. I'm coming. Godzilla. Nackness. <laughs> Nessie. Nessie Zilla. No Zilla. Nessie <laughs> Nessie Zilla. No, that's stupid. Nessie Zilla. How about Nazilla? Nazilla. Nazilla. No Zilla. I'll, I'll, I'll hit middle ground and go with Nazilla. Log Nazilla. Nazilla. Knock Nazilla. Lock Nazilla. Lock Nazilla. Okay, this is fucking stupid. This is Okay, all right. Give me another one. Uh, how about the most famous, uh, Bigfoot? Yeah, okay, we're gonna go there. I thought you were gonna say that for last. Okay, um, we can save that. No, nah, I'm going Bigfoot now. Oh, go pogo. <laughs> All right, what about the Bigfoot? The Bigfoot. Well, okay, let's let's say recent sightings. Uh, have there been? Oh, God, when was like the last one? Every time you see one on YouTube, they always like debunk it as being fake. Yeah, I think know? that the last one was really debunked. Didn't they see him like walking across like an? Wait, wasn't it? Uh, Bigfoot and like a little baby Bigfoot. The last one that yeah, happened, yeah. right? Oh, that yeah, show? that was right. The one in like yeah. Arizona, right? Uh huh. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot about that. It was one. in uh, 2007. Is that the baby Bigfoot too? Uh, Hunter no, 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 Rick was... Jacobs captured an image of supposed Sasquatch by using automatically triggered camera attached to a tree, prompting a spokesperson for Pennsylvania Game Commission to say that it was probably an image of a bear with severe case of manage mange mange 
<laughs> he was a manager. Oh, that's a bear good one. manager. So he just has weird hair patches. <laughs> yeah, he's like fuck you. Like, oh, and the last sighting of Nancy he's like, ah, was in 2014. Manager. 2014, really? Yeah. What? That this close? year? Uh, it was because of uh, somebody was using like Apple Maps, and then people were giving an explanation for that too. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. But I remember the one with the baby, where they had the little baby Sasquatch yeah, right, right like behind A couple them. weeks ago, was it? Wasn't there one like like a couple weeks ago where they're like, "There's a picture of like the baby Bigfoot and Big Big Bigfoot." Yeah, you know, <laughs> you know out in the, Arizona. Kind of fucked up is that reality show? Whereas, um, oh yeah, I do remember. People that. watched that; they were just so upset at the end of it because <laughs> nothing happened. Oh yeah, <laughs> like where did you think this was gonna go? I know that I know. you were gonna actually fucking see Bigfoot. Like they would t- release it as a TV <laughs> program first. Uh, really not. Like people. it would hit the news and shit before that. Like this is a major fucking discovery. It's but we're gonna save it for television. Yeah, we're so gullible. Like, <laughs> uh, motor vehicle department found it because they were watching like you know the cameras and then they saw uh-huh. what they thought was Bigfoot go across. So what was it? I don't think they gave an explanation for it. I yeah, think, yeah, it's like a highway shot like, walking across the street uh, or something yeah. like that. Like, what's up, y'all? I just want Alf. Sorry, I was just. Alf. I don't know why I went there. So you want an alien? <laughs> you want yeah. <laughs> He's a mythical creature too. Cause my thing is seeing is believing. So yeah. this is like everything else, like seeing is believing. So do we actually debunk debunk all these things because we haven't necessarily seen them? I know the one from like the nineteen seventies, you know, the one of the shot of him yeah, walking. The, shot, yeah. the guy looking back like, some guy that? some guy said, you know, I was hired to be dressed up as Bigfoot. Oh you yeah. You know, and I'm like why would you come out now? Why didn't you come out sooner? Yeah, because wasn't he on his deathbed? Maybe he was. Yeah. I think yeah, he was. Yeah, was. I think one. he was on his deathbed and he revealed it to like yeah. his daughter or one of his like kids or something like that. Yeah. Or some family member. And then they came out like, yeah, he said this. He that he did it. So what? Are you debunking that? I don't know. Hmm. I can I can, I'm kind of skeptic on it, you know. Yeah. Cuz like why I mean, not everything people say on their deathbeds can be true, you know. <laughs> uh-huh. I mean, sometimes they give something weird out, you know. But, you know, we'll never know, really, till we find that Bigfoot costume. Yes. <laughs> yeah. W- wouldn't you think he would keep it? Or did he's like, oh, no, I, I am Bigfoot. I must be. No one should ever know. <laughs> but then why the fuck did you reveal it? So, yeah, yeah that wouldn't make sense. Like, cause wouldn't you just take that to your grave? Yeah. Like, let the legend. Let the legend live. Live, you know? You just keep handing it down. So, yeah, that's true. Like, I don't know. I, I would like to, I don't, I don't, you know, spit on anybody's grave or anything yeah, like that. Yeah, but right. it's like. What really? Are you gonna tell us now? If you're gonna say anything, wouldn't you want that notoriety before you, your death? Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, I, yep, I did this. And instead of like this bomb, and then it's like, okay, we can't ask you any questions about it. Yeah, but yeah, you just told us, oh, okay, so now we can't really, uh, we can't vet it. You revealed I don't the know secret. If it's, now, now what? Yeah, I don't know if it's true or not. Still, I'm still like hanging. It's still hanging out there in the in the ether. I don't know. Were there sightings after he had said that, though? I think so. Yeah, there's... Yeah. there's there have oh, been a few, yeah. But, so... <clears throat> what about, like, the the exp- expeditions? Now, we have all these many... You know, uh, people do this shit. They yeah, really, They're actually aficion- aficionados out there who go out searching for Bigfoot. So, why haven't they come out back with any information? I don't think I fucking see on the shows. It's like... It's like the damn ghost shows and shit yeah. like that. We oh, my God, there watch, is, Oh, my God, it's over there. Like... Oh. No, that's just a oh, this that's is a, a moth. Yeah, <laughs> that's a big fucking that's moth. A, oh shit! That's, what, is that a wallaby? No, I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> oh my god! There's ectoplasm coming out of my pants because <laughs> they pissed themselves. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> so sad. That was from the South Park. Oh really? <laughs> Random fucking quote <laughs> says hey, you got a ding. We we'll put like we we'll put like a little meter. Random little, quote. Random meter. quotes. <laughs> I gotta put a counter on there because I have a. They have this thing where you put a counter. You're like quotes. <laughs> quotes for this episode by Chris. <laughs> yeah, and then I'll just have to listen to it all and then record them and then you know yeah. reference them back. But um, yeah, I don't. <sighs> I, I want yeah. to believe. I want, yeah, I really do. I think if if there's anything I want to believe in, it's Bigfoot and segue into vampires. I don't know why, but okay. it just sounds so like romantic. Yeah. <laughs> but not the Twilight. Yeah, no, no, I like the like 
Dude, dude, like the dude's just come on and fucking sucking blood. Dude's sparkling like and sucking my blood. Not like that though. No, not, you gotta. <laughs> wants I like. I don't know. It's, I don't know because like me, I'm an Anne Rice fan. So I'm like, her vampires are freaking dope. <laughs> I love her vampires because vampires have story and you know someone kind of crazy and uh, they just drink blood just cause. But then there's like Lestat who's just wilding out and stuff. And then you have um, Jerry wants to meet Angel. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> You, like you wouldn't do that show back then. <laughs> you want a vampire detective? Oh, I know. <laughs> you know you want it. I would rather meet Spike. No oh, fuck Spike. I don't like Angel, man. Angel's better. Spike was a badass. He was a badass, but he's a little <laughs> bitch. How does he go from being all <laughs> evil and shit to oh, I side with good? Fuck you, Spike. That's called poor writing. That's yeah, what it's that's what that, was. that was like no. Fanfare. That's yeah, what that's, that's, that's called. Like, it really uh, was. Fanfare is poor writing. We didn't want to kill them all because you got all you little ladies love the little cute, like, whatever he is. British guy. Isn't he British? Yeah, yeah I think I'm he's a British. Sure. Yeah, British blonde guy. So let's bring him back as a, uh, like, sidekick. He's redeemed himself. <laughs> You're still evil, bitch. <laughs> like, seriously. How did that show end? Did he die? Hopefully. Everybody died. Uh, yeah, did everybody died in Angel. <laughs> yeah, remember? I, I don't remember. Like the apocalypse happened, oh. and oh, uh, I was just kidding because I didn't. Uh, I never watched <laughs> Angel. You didn't watch Angel? I never watched Shit. Angel. Oh yeah, like uh, <laughs> Wesley killed uh, Leslie, and or no, Wes killed somebody, and then uh, he okay. had uh, the Green Dude kill Leslie. I can't remember his name. You know, the I green can't. dude who... The horns, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. he was a bartender, uh, yeah. the owner of that club. He was like seeing yeah. kind of savvy guy. He actually survived because... Oh, did he? Yeah. Because he, he's a demon. He killed Leslie and then he could see he was all like upset about it and he left and that was the end of him. Everyone and, died. The end. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, I don't remember any of that. I'm about to watch that last episode somewhere. Do they have that on Netflix? I think it's on Netflix it's on or Netflix. Hulu. <laughs> yeah, it's on... Dude, I think it's actually... Could you imagine doing a binge of like Angel or Buffy? I'm just saying, I love that show. <laughs> All right, like, whatever. So vampires, I don't know. I don't like seeing and believing, but you know, I was always into vampire lore and stuff like that. Yeah. And I was like, stuff like that. God damn, why do I always say that? I was always uh, always into like vampire lore. So I would, especially with Anne Rice and stuff. And so then I started um um um, um investigating or researching like Elizabeth of Bathory and the Elizabeth true Bathory. legends. The real Dracula, yeah, the Vlad Ballad, the Vlad the Vlad, Vlad. horribly played in this damn movie. Dracula Untold. resurrected or what Untold. is it? Untold. Like, come on, they tried, yeah, but they missed the mark by making him a redeemable person. Yeah, I know. Like, right? <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna fight for the good. No, he was fucking. Evil. You know they're trying to make that Still. into like a whole franchise of like Universal monsters. Oh, I'm not saying that. Oh, Universal monsters because yeah. I do want to see Dracula Untold two. Yeah, yeah, they're doing a sequel. Oh, because the way they left it, the yeah, cliffhanger they left it, was they left dope. It open for Dracula and other like yeah. monsters. Yes, yeah. yeah. So I'm okay. like, I'm interested to see. I'm because, I'm yeah. open because you know, the, the the real the, the one who gave him the venom, the blood, the the, the Dracula, the the, the 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 his blood, it'd be like he would be like the the origin va- vampire, the original vampire, the OV, you know? the OV. He would be like in the in, in the um theory thereof, he would be like Cain. Yeah. In some theories, Kane. you know, Cain yeah. walks away, he lives forever, and so they say Cain is um, a vampire, vampire, you know, the original vampire and stuff. So, and so he would have the blood of Cain. And so Cain, let's just, in this retrospect, this demon that he receives his blood from, from to make him all powerful, he shows up at the end, you know, but he's like a regular person. He's draped out because when he took his blood, he released them, you know? <laughs> so, because um, he was like in prison and stuff like that. Go watch the movie. It, it was, it was great. Uh, it, uh, they had action and stuff like that, so it kept me interested. It was, in, but it was, I was an just entertaining like, movie. As far as the story will, goes, it's a you're not really movie. impressing me because I want Vlad to be Vlad, 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 Vlad. who Vlad. he is. He was just an evil damn person. Yeah. He was just fucking horrible. No, he was a fucked up motherfucker. <laughs> he, he was horrible, man. Oh, yeah. And Elizabeth of Bathory, oh, what's her name? Did Julie Depley did one. And then they also had this Romanian um movie made. No, Scandinavian. No, no, it was made in one of those, one of those um east far eastern countries. They made another one, uh, Elizabeth of Elizabeth. No, um, oh, of that. Yeah, she is Elizabeth Bathory. Okay, Elizabeth Bathory. Sorry. Um, <laughs> she. They have like two congruent like stories storylines going there. I haven't watched them, but yeah, I really want to. 
because I was like so transfixed by her too. I'm like, I want to see her in something else. But they were trying to tell the real story of her because she fucked up too. Well, she was just a real pl- person just bathing in people's blood. Yep. That's Young just what she bloods. did. Young. Young virgin maiden because it made her, it rejuvenated her skin. Oh, great yep. story. <laughs> What's his face? Dove should use that. But yet she goes on like, you know, because she had a tremendous, she was abused, she was raped a lot. She had this just in her mind. And so then she married this crazy fuck. Uh, who actually taught her how to do these things to torture people? She married like a character like Vlad, but yet it wasn't him. You know, some people would say that he came back and he told her, no, 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 no. Her husband was messed up too. <laughs> he hey, Adam. Was, yeah. You want to talk about Asian vampires? No. Did it? Oh, they do have They do have their they own have versions. Them. Yeah. Which have the, what what's they it called? called? I can't remember what they're called, but they have like that the scripture on their face and they jump. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. They're they're leaping vampires, and then there's this one from Bali that um, it's an entrails and a woman's head, and it sucks babies out of women's. Ooh, I've read about that one. Yeah. Yes, that's freaky. That's from I I, I saw that in a sucker. movie called Mystics in Bali. Oh really? Which is a really fucking. Was it? It's like a, it's actually a film. It's a it's a it's from Bali. Yeah. Oh. And it's okay. a really <laughs> it's it's a low budget like 1980s. I want to say it's 81 or 80. It's low budget. It's really entertaining because the shit's going everywhere. Yeah. There's fucking big titted pig demon stuff. And oh. like frog lipped witches. Really? Yeah. It's it's a funny one. Was it well made? No. For their standards, Probably it's produced. scary. But for our standards, it's not scary because it's, it's really meant for them. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah, like you can tell, like sometimes it's a shot of like. Oh, of a a head on a string with entrails <laughs> on, on a string just going across the sky and like they're trying to hit it like a pinata in one scene and then like other scenes it's like it's like self-imposed you know it's like it, it's it's an entertaining one yeah mystics and bali okay sweet go check that out people another <laughs> now let's go <laughs> another b plus movie all right so well so uh, we've covered what um vampires bigfoot Nessie. vampires bigfoot hey Nessie. adam how about you nessie bigfoot and now vampires. What's another one? The Yeti. The Yeti. Yeti. You know, there's so many different hairy motherfuckers. Yeah. Hairy ape ones that yeah. almost every area has one. I know Africa has one. I can't remember what it's called. Australia has one. Okay. Uh-huh. You know, it, Asia has like a couple of them. See, whenever you say that, all that stuff, that means I have to go look up all that stuff and put those names in the show notes. Go ahead. Just, <laughs> but keep keep I know, going. I can't remember their names. But I, keep I, going, I apologize. though, some bitch. They're so goddamn many. <laughs> Just, you can't put, just leave it out there for people not to know what anything, the fuck it is. <laughs> they're just Bigfoot. They're all Bigfoot. Yeah, they're, they're Bigfoot. literally all just Bigfoot, but so, of that country. So is that that's what the Yeti is to me. Yeti is just like a Himalayan, Bigfoot. Himalayan Bigfoot. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's a white Bigfoot. Yeah. So why does he get his own name? Why don't he just like Himalayan Bigfoot? Why don't we just name him? Well, by that's that's country? his name. That's his name. There is the Yeti. That's what they always known him as. You but know? what is it? What does Yeti mean? Does it mean Himalayan Bigfoot? No. No. So they should call it Himalayan Bigfoot. Well, that's, Bigfoot just, white. that's our American way of saying. <gasps> How about Bigfoot White? White Bigfoot. No, Bigfoot White. Okay, Bigfoot White. I like, that's good. Sounds Why funny. you gotta okay. make it about color? Because he is white. He lives in. He has to reflect snow. Isn't polar that? bear. Oh, so wow. if I go to the Arctic, Arctic and I see a Yeti, well, that's not where he is. Okay, he's not there. He's in the he's Himalayas. In Himalayas. What if I say we go on a hike? Where? Himalayas. We're not going to the Himalayas. Why not? I see people do it. There's dead people there. I know because they get to that point yeah. and they die. It's fucked up. Yeah. Didn't somebody recently do that? But then wasn't there like nineteen year old kid who climbed with his parents and he they they survived. Mm. They got to the, the to the peak. But yeah, there is that one part where that cave yeah. where people go. But why would you stop there if you see all that? Mm. I know it's a place uh, you know to 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 like there's to, a there's like bodies yeah. strewn all over the place. Yeah. Like frozen and dead, Dude, you know. That is wild. really grim. Wouldn't that be weird? No, I wouldn't climb that. Yeah. It's like a fucking graveyard. Yeah. But yet, but think about it, though. Want but think about it. Yes. I went there, and I fucking died doing what I wanted to do. That's life right there, man. That's life, son. But you're not getting no, it. <laughs> but your body's stuck up there. No one's going to try to get it. Oh, hell no, like, yeah. But that's beautiful. It's there's strenuous something, on the body. I'm sorry, but there's something beauty, uh, beautiful in that. Think about that. Okay, I'm going to take you down and put you in the motherfucking ground. No. That's not where I want it to be. I died here. It's like it's it's like if you wrote your name in in snow, or carved it in a tree, or, or pissed, pissed it's a fucking snow. tombstone. 
And he carves, you know, like, this is me. This is my tombstone. My body is my tombstone. Like, I, I'm gone. I'm, I'm ascended or descended if I was a bad person. But uh, if you believe that. I want to be cremated uh, be into, I want to be cremated and left somewhere hidden in the theater. I oh, I want to be cremated and then I want every kid, I want to be put in tea bags. I want every kid to drink part of me. <laughs> they can get sick from that. I don't give a fuck. Like really sick. From they'll that. get a little sick and then they'll be okay. Unless I possess them. <laughs> Which I would like to do. Dun, dun, dun. But no, I think there's there's beauty in that. Kind of fucked up. It's scary. Yes, but there's, there's beauty no beauty in your that, that they went I want my and they tried some me. shit. They tried something. Yeah. They went, they put balls to the wall. Like, you know what? I'm just going to do this. I know. I know the risk. But I'm gonna go do it anyway. That that's the recipe for life. Just say like instead of I want to die on the Himalayas. I know I want to conquer the Himalayas. It 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 just be metaphorically. I want to conquer life. I want to conquer my fear. I'm just saying, son. I'm trying to get all like you know introspective here. No, just get all. <laughs> but no. So wait, what else to talk? <laughs> no, not to talk about. Well, well, we- what else? What the Yeti ate them all. <laughs> Well, they're just freezing. He he stores them there, you know. Okay, keeps them frozen. But if we like frozen food. if we what if he just what if he's like vampiric and he drinks the blood? Uh huh. That's lame. Oh, I'm just saying. He wants a good meal. What if he just sucks the blood out of them? And that's why they're frozen in time. Y- Yeti so frozen in time because they're roughly frozen. translates to bear. So basically, it's just a big fucking bear. So it's a polar bear, right? Well, <laughs> no, they do have bears there. They do have a Himalayan bear, which a polar is pretty bear? big. It's not. It's not polar bear. Is he white? No. Okay, what if what if they cross paths? Who wins? Dun, 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 is that bear big? Dun, dun, How big is that bear? Dun, dun, dun. How big is the Yeti? I would is think, it like Bigfoot? I would like twelve? I think he would be like seven uh not seven. Alright, right. can we go into like talk about Bigfoot? Yeah, let's go into the movie. <laughs> Harry and the Hendersons. Harry and the oh! Hendersons. I love that movie. <laughs> oh shit, I love me some Harry and the Hendersons. <laughs> that's that's the movie that inspired me to love Bigfoot and Bigfoot right? movies. I think that's why I'm so drawn to like a Bigfoot being real rather than Harry and the Hendersons. like anything else because they, they actually made him a person. Yeah. <laughs> and he was lovable. Oh, was and say. if you think about it, maybe he just wants to like conform to society. He wants to be a part of our world, but he can't because Gonna try to kill Yes, him. because maybe he had an experience. Yeah. He tried to knock on the cabin door. Motherfuckers just shot before they looked. Yeah. And he was like, oh shit, we're not messing with them. So these humans, I'm gonna stay I'm gonna stay away from them. But you know, I'm gonna pick poke my head around the corners every now and then and oh shit, there was a hunter. <gasps> I look back, that's when they shot that picture. I didn't know what it was, but you know, copyrights. I didn't sign off on anything, but they're using that image everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I know my rights now. <laughs> but Harry and the Hendersons, man. Oh, I love that movie. Wasn't that just a great movie? He's so Have lovable. You seen it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my yeah. goodness. Hey, come on, people. Go watch. I want to go watch that right now. I, I want to sit I, down with the I family. That, that was a DVD. family movie to that watch with Harry and the Hendersons, man. <laughs> do not remake that. Oh, God, no. I will kill. It'll be a fucking crappy CG, Harry. I will go to Harry. your house. Oh, yeah, that's what would happen. burn it down. It'd be CG. <laughs> Dude, that's how I am. Yeah. That's, that's how I am with I'll Short Circuit. I do not want to see a remake of that. They tried that a couple I years know. ago. I know. And they were going to get the guy from Alvin and the Chipmunks. Ooh. I'm like, no. 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 Do not mess with Short Circuit. Fucking that's Short another Circuit thing. One Once two. we have a show about robots. Oh, robots we love. Maybe oh. before Chappie comes out. Maybe. Yeah. That'd okay. be a good one. But... Okay, so I wanted to do five. <coughs> Give me the fifth monster. Mythical creature. Jersey. Oh, Devil. no. Leprechauns. Hoi de toy, toy de hoi de Leprechaun, holy. son. Leprechaun, son. Leprechauns aren't a cryptoid, though. They're a fucking creepy little monster. Hey, don't you remember the Alabama leprechaun? Yo, I want his gold. <laughs> you remember that news report? <laughs> There's like these people in like Alabama, I think, and like, it's... <laughs> Sorry. I hate to be racist, but they were all black, and they're all trying to get a leprechaun that was in a tree that didn't exist. <laughs> and it's really freaking funny. <laughs> Are you looking at the picture of the of one of them, Drew? No, I, there's a phantom kangaroo. I, I, can oh. believe that. I can believe that. Oh, is this Ozzy one? Aussie. Uh, the phantom kangaroo is located. Iggy Azalea <laughs> No sorry and, Iggy wow. Azalea's asshole <laughs> and, and lots of places uh, France, Poland, Germany, what? Japan, New Zealand, UK Why the fuck the do US. they have can- kangaroos Phantom in England? kangaroo Oh no Get the damn kangaroo That's a hopping mouse That's called, a, that's <laughs> called Spring Hill Jack <laughs> The hopping mouse I think we found episode one
<laughs> I hate everything. But uh, the there's also a phantom cat. Yeah, I've heard of phantom. What cat. about the banshee? Uh, Banshee's like a ghost. Okay. Banshee is a so screaming that's not a cryptoid. Yeah. What's another cryptoid? Well, ghosts are technically cryptoids. Well, would they be considered cryptoids? What? I don't think so. Well, they're more monsters than anything. Yeah. It's yeah. yeah, yeah, like a vampire is not really. Define cryptoid for me because I don't. A vampire isn't a cryptoid either. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. But it's a mythical. No, you're no, right. No, not really. You're all right. Oops, I just threw that in there for nothing. So sorry. Yeah, well, other cultures do have, like, their own, like, fictional versions. Yeah. But they're more just monsters than cryptoids. Mm -hmm. A cryptoid would, I would think it would be defined as a creature of unknown origin in a, that that is real, you know, in reality. Built in reality, not based on myth or anything like that. Oh, that makes sense, yeah. I think that's what a cryptoid would be. Nice, okay. Okay. <laughs> Chupacabra would be considered yeah, a Chupacabra. Chupacabra would okay. be one. Chupacabra. Okay, okay. Well, let's do that. We're a little close to fucking um, Mexico. Yeah. And, and you know, and we and have they, signs. They've they, they yeah. stayed like goats. They said it's We've in, seen dead goats and pictures of dead goats and stuff along the border and stuff yep. like that. But yet, yeah, it could just be goat people sucker. killing goats. goats but yep. yet. Who's mutilating these goats, what man? What do you think, though? It do you could, think that, the, like, what would it be? What Was that the Chupacabra? Yeah, he looks like a little. He, he, he looks like a little turtle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they well, really, like, turtle slash alien mix. <laughs> like I've heard different stories. People think chupacabra is just a pet of an alien that got left behind mm. and eats goats. Then there's like, people who think it's just a coyote with mange, which is what a lot of people like. Whenever they, but see that's what they said about fucking Bigfoot. Hey, a bear with mange. Yeah, hmm, that's interesting. A but bear that bear manger. would be a bear with mange and taller and thinner. Yeah. Because, yeah, he was kind of slender. Yeah. Even in that picture, he was just tall and lanky. Kind of, you know, big, big, but he wasn't like big bear big. Like, yeah. rum belly. Hey, look up a coyote with mange, and then there'll be a news article with, it's the chubacabra. Oh, well, but he doesn't suck blood, though. That's why you get Yeah. Because they had a lot of these goats without blood. Yep, it's true. Hmm. That's what I wonder. Could I'm it like- just be like a um, weird strand of um, mosquito? I don't think Where's like are fucking drink that much blood. Have you been to the south? <laughs> no. Motherfuckers are huge. <laughs> yeah. they, they are you the don't mis- fuck with no damn mosquitoes, the mosquitoes in the from south, Jumanji. Son. Huh? <laughs> There's the mosquitoes from Jumanji. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody conjured them or something. <laughs> <laughs> they, they're like we can havoc along the border side. <laughs> they can't cross, you know, either or. They can't really go into Mexico or. You know, it's all like rights or something. They can't cross the border. I don't okay. know. It's like a mythical line in between us. Yeah. And they can't do it. What, is that supposed to be it? Does okay. it have horns? A coyote with mange. Oh. But it was spotted in Mississippi. And You're one ugly motherfucker. It was, they have coyotes in and Mississippi. And it was thought to be a chupacabra. Yeah, they got, like, all around the south, we got, there's coyotes. Really? Yeah. Oh. What the hell? I always thought that was a also, western co- dog. Coyotes also <laughs> live, I think, a bit more north. Yeah. I mean, they really? do get hairier, you Man, know? Man, fuck that shit. Coyotes are That's called a wolf. You're going to get eaten. No, <laughs> coyotes are smaller. Well, the coyote... No, no. They're like food. Wolf food. Wolf food, basically. Yeah, wolves don't fuck with coyotes. What? Yeah. Why? A they wolf is don't. so much damn bigger. And plus, they got a lot of homies. Yeah, but so do coyotes. But they're little scrawny. They're like little hyenas. I don't know. They're scrawny. The hy- hyenas of the Americas. <laughs> they're not the hyenas of America. They're fucking annoying. Have you heard them though? Yeah. They're fucking beautiful. They sound beautiful. But I wanted to write something on this, but a coyote, like I was listening. It was like one night I had come home from work, one, two o'clock in the morning. I just heard them. Like, but then I started thinking, I'm like, oh, like Indian cries. Like, yeah. they're like, I'm like, who's mimicking who? What if the coyotes are just mimicking the sounds of the humans? You know, that, that, that cry because. They, if you if you just do some research and you like hear some of the uh, like the Indian cries and stuff of old and stuff, if they yeah. have old recordings, but you got to get the good stuff, not the like Hollywood makes you know, biographies yeah. or something like that, or you know, some of these indigenous like even like in other countries, some of these indigenous um, um peoples, and they they have this cries and stuff, but it sounds so rhythmic, rhythmic, rhythmically like 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 a coyote or something like that. So I'm like. Wait, so I wasn't smoking anything. I was just thinking, like, what if, like, the coyotes are just mimicking the humans? Like, you know, I, I think that would be fucking beautiful. Something, I don't know. Like, you know, because, you know, how far Indians and land and the animals and stuff like that, and correlation and the relationship between. See, that's some. 
That's what my mind goes. So I'm sorry about that. See, I know a That's lot a about <laughs> Native American uh like literature, you know, mythology yeah. and stuff like that. And there's a lot about the coyote, you know? Yeah. yeah. And it's it's pretty clear that they were inspired by the coyote. Oh, they were? Oh, yeah. okay, yeah. But I was just like, what if an alternate, what if it was what the other if? way around? Yeah. Oh, it'd be something beautiful, you know? Would be. Well, on that note, what are you doing? You look like you have something to say. Oh, no, I was just looking at other ones. Oh, good chupacabras? No. Oh, did we ever say anything <laughs> about the chupacabras? Not really. Oh, it's a dog with mange. <laughs> it's like blood. No, I don't know. You hear these stories. I've heard a lot of them. They're, actually, with these, though, there have been sightings of yeah. sorts where ranchers would come out and say, I saw this thing race off into the darkness. And it it was, it was small. And it had like, did it say horns? Did they usually say horns? Or, I they say horns. I don't know. But it says it's like small and it didn't it like smile at them or something? Or maybe. And like I don't know, they saw the face and like big bug eyes or something like that. Yeah. They do say yeah. it has like big eyes and they're like reddish or something, and then they just ran off. Hmm. So they're kind of small and stuff. So it could have been like that little alien creature that we saw, <laughs> <laughs> right. but mixed in with some like kind of human hybrid. That it, is it is is there any like chance of it being human noid? Hmm. Humanoid? Oh, it could be a chud. Cannibalistic humanoid underground dweller. Okay, and with that, this is Talking with Burritos. <laughs> I am Jerry <laughs> JJ Grail. I am Adam Adolf Snyder. I'm Chris the Rupal. <laughs> and that's a wrap, but not a burrito.